you have no delivery job. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my channel. Apparently my record button is also tied in with some other weird button now that my everything stopped working on my computer. Uh, OBS got updated and it no longer supports my stream deck, so I've had to do sh keyboard shortcuts, which is always a joy. Anyway, we are here in the Dolls, I believe it's pronounced, and mm -hmm. it's in Washington. And we are going to look for a job. Let me see what I can find. Job market. External contracts. Um, we could go to... Would you guys like to go to Kalispell? Absolutely. Absolutely. I love can of spells. <laughs> can of spells? Is that what it is? No, Kalispell. Oh, no can of spells. Okay. Yes, it is a city in... Uh, and here I thought we Montana. were going to do a D&D &D night. Darn. D&D &D night. D&D &D with trucks. We call right. it TNT. Your trailer is ready. My steering wheel is not working. All yeah, right. just because I was right. stupid. I forgot I changed the settings and the, no, you no longer can press the gas to start the truck. That is my fault. Where's my diff button? Okay, there we go. Yeah. So where do I access my skills? Um, Cyber manager? It'll um, say just it'll um, say just skills. Avius, come on. You got no skills. You ain't got no skills. Well, you're right. <laughs> I, don't, I don't have the second long distance. I can't take that job. Oh, poo. Oh, so somebody what? screwed us over. Ahem. <clears throat> Well, I can just look for a job. No, 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 no. We'll do this the right. Okay. We're no longer taking dumpsters to Kalispell. Let's go to job market. <laughs> External market. And we are in here. And what do I How do I cancel job? Can you make it to Grangerville, Idaho? Let me try taking this job and see if we can. How do I lose this job? I'm still showing you have the dumpster. Yeah, I have to abandon it. Hopefully it doesn't charge me money Where for Where do that. I abandon that? Uh, Break market? Yeah. It's in here. It'll say at the top left hand what your job is, I think, and then you've got to cancel it. Hmm. So I'm just going to. We could also go to Newport. Oh, there uh, we go. Because that's a shorter trip. Does that sound good? If we just take a short trip, that way for sure you can get it. And then when, then you'll yeah. you get I don't know what happened last time that I took the high value. <laughs> well, Mike and I will be skilling up high value on the next one, and you can skill up long distance. That way we're all the same. Yes, I'm t I have that job. Okay, good. Good, good. Okay. Let us move to the trailer. Oh, yeah. Did you say I'm a genius? No, I said Javius. Tell you. Javius. I'll tell you how much of a genius I am. <laughs> Yesterday, I went to the. I took my car to the oil change place. Because we haven't changed oil since the baby came. And I, I, I had an appointment on the day the baby was born, so I had to cancel it. And so my car was like, ooh, maybe a thousand miles over the oil change. <laughs> um, well, did you, are you doing ten or fives? Uh, I'm doing uh, one hundred percent synthetic. Well, that doesn't. What are you? What are you doing? You doing the three thousand mile, five thousand, or ten thousand? Five thousand. Uh, I whatever the for their full synthetic is. They don't tell you. They just say this is when you got to come in. Maybe. So it should be fives, honestly. Yeah. I was going to say, I wouldn't do anything over five. Yeah, I did four and a half, I think, thousand, but maybe more. I don't know. But I went over. So the point is, I went to the oil place. And the guy's under there. Now, keep in mind, three months ago when I got my oil changed, they're like, hey, you're probably going to need new tires. You can probably get six months out of these, blah, blah, blah. Okay. You know, so the guy's looking at my tires, and he's like, dude. And I'm like, yeah. And he's like, I, I've never seen tires this bad before i'm like what do you mean he's like like your bands are sticking through 
which would explain why the car was running so rough because it was like really vibrating when you would run it. But I knew the I knew I needed new tires. So I thought, well, just well, the tires are cupped. You know, they get cupped after a while, and you gotta replace them. So he's like, "This is like these tires are ready to blow," and I'm like, "Uh." Now, keep in mind, this is the oil change place. They don't sell tires there, okay? So it wasn't like he was trying to get me to buy tires from him. He's like, I'll tell you what, I got a friend that works over here. Go down there and talk to them. I'm like, oh, dang it. Like, when I had those tires, when they gave me the estimate for the replacements at, uh, at Kia, because I usually get my oil changed at the dealership, they were like, um, yeah, it, you know, like $1,000 for the tires. And I'm just like... I don't, uh, that's a lot of money. Do you want to go first, Javius? Go ahead. Um, and so I, uh, oh, are you, are you in the same slot that I'm taking, right? Right next to the super flatbed low boy thing. Oh, no, you're not. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, we have different ones. So I went over there, and I'm, I'm like, dude, like, I've only got $500. Like, I am not going to be. There's, like, one tire now, or two tires now, and then a couple later. Yes. Yeah, like, maybe I should do. But, you know, that's always terrible, too, because then you're dealing with, like, unevenly worn tires. And, you know, it's like. So I'm like. Well, it's that or, you know. I had to do something. So I went in, and the guy's like, he's like, well, how much do you, what's your budget? And I said, listen, I'm like, maximum $500. Like, that's all I got. And he's like, well, let me see what I got. And he's like, he comes back, he's like, you know what? We have our sport tire, like our, our brand sport tire, and there it would be 450 for the set. I'm like, for all four? And he's like, yeah. I'm like, oh. So we, we did it. So I got a whole new set of tires for, for, for 450 and they're actually really nice tires. Now, they're only 35,000-mile tires, but that's all my other tires were also. Because when you have the sport tires, they don't they don't last as long. But these actually have a little bit better cut than my old tires do. So I should have less trouble this winter. Because these actually have some tread to them. They won't stick as good like with uh, if you're doing sport stuff. But I don't really do sport stuff anyway. So Pull up next to us. What is Mike... Uh... What'd you say? Pretty sure that was Micah who just went. Yes, into it was. <laughs> yes. It oh, was. I'm just playing the role. I'm a UPS guy. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> X UPS truck. <laughs> you don't know where I worked before. No. <laughs> <laughs> X UPS driver. Yeah. You would know better. So we're going to get these uh, <clears throat> Peterbilts rolling. Uh, I got yelled at last time because for some reason I said Peterbilt, I guess. I don't really these watch. These are Kenworth. Yeah, these are Kenworth, right. I don't really watch my own videos, <laughs> but apparently sometimes I do. But sometimes I didn't watch this one. Apparently I said I called these Kenworths. I don't remember. Or Peterbilts, I mean. I don't yeah, remember. Peterbilts, yeah. Um, so oops. I heard an English guy call them Petterbilts. Petterbilts? <laughs> Uh, well, in, in in all fairness, in Finland, they that's of course, it's spelled with two T's, though. Uh, Petter is a name. So, like, Petter Solberg is a famous rally racer, and now his kid, something Solberg, uh, is also racing. Like, it's got to be different. All right, so we got our UPS truck loads here. We're blocking the road. Go ahead, you go first, Micah. Keep it, uh, well, keep it around 55. Yes, my darling. Through town? Sure. Yeah. There's Dalmatians locked upstairs. We'll just leave them up there. They're stupid. Dalmatian puppies or our Dalmatians, Bella and Hermione? Okay, we'll just leave them. I'll get them in a little bit. Stupid dogs. When we stop for the night, I'll let them down. But they can wait like 20 minutes or so. Because they're dumb. And once again, I misshifted. <laughs> Tell you what, that doesn't happen very often in real life. Hope not. 
there's a cost. Well, of course it doesn't happen in real life. I mean, <laughs> your tires are destroyed. <laughs> so you're burning rubber probably every time you're just dropping the clutch, uh, right? Maybe. No, I've never dropped the clutch in that car. Okay. I have... I did have one bad shift today, though. I was... I pulled out and didn't realize the car that was coming up was coming really fast, so I tried to get in the second real quick, and I was like... <laughs> I'm like, oh, oops. I didn't push the clutch far enough in. Uh, that's going to leave a mark. Now the... Uh, Ooh. Train tracks. Train tracks. They're blinking. Oh, there... I thought they were blinking. I was going to try and get on the tracks and park. See what happens. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Just to see. Micah, have you been drinking again? Yeah, I've been drinking uh, Mellow Yellow. Mellow Yellow. That sounds good. And I'm not mellow from the yellow. <laughs> It is funny how they call it Mellow Yellow, and yet it really is just a very caffeinated drink. Yeah, I like Mellow Yellow over uh, Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew. Mountain Drool. Mountain Drool. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, the dolls. And it's pretty here. I'm actually... It is pretty. Yeah. Correct me if I'm wrong, but this is something they've added since it came since Washington came out, right? Like I don't think this don't was know. here originally. Well, we were in Oregon currently, so I mean Oregon, sorry. Um, That's Washington I'm, across the river. I don't know if I've ever been on this road before here. I know the town has been here all along. Yeah, I love this truck. I know, me too. I just have a hard time not whacking the right side of it in this stuff. For whatever reason, it's just... Probably because I'm used to Euro truck and how wide those flat fronts are. So this one, you just have to be careful and you make sure you gotta, you got to stay a little further left. Because it's a lot wider. You know, there's a truck I've, I've seen uh, on my way... Where is it? It's somewhere that I've had to go a couple times recently. I, I think it's down Route 3. There is an old Ford. I've never seen one like it before, and I don't know if the guy customized it, but it's kind of like the 9000 series from SnowRunner. I can bypass the way station. I cannot. Okay. It's kind of like the one from SnowRunner, but it's older. And it, I, I wish I could get a picture of it. It only, it looks almost like the Trans Star, and it's kind of the same size as the Trans Star. Hmm. It's See. a real, it's a really cool truck. For some reason, CLT is coming to mind. Like a Ford CLT. Yeah. That's a nine thousand. Is it? Yeah. I'll have to look it up. That's it's pro it's probably like a, a it's probably like a CLT five thousand or something or like that. You know what I mean? Like how they. They all have the same thing, but they change the numbers. I don't have my phone. I can't look it up. Always something that's by me. Do, 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 do. Keep rolling, Micah. We're coming. Well, there's a... Okay. Just go slow. Javius, are you through? <laughs> I'm through, but we got a gallon oil truck in between. Yeah, I want the door shut. You're breaking my immersion. <laughs> and here I thought I was in Oregon. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh. Micah is on fire this week. <laughs> the Micah so, Show uh, with Arthur uh, and yeah, Javius. <laughs> well, I, I went to the I went to rehab today and they uh, helped me with my shoulder, so it's feeling uh, it's feeling a bit better today. Oh, they helped you with your drinking. No, um, I uh, got impingements in my right shoulder. Ooh. So it's yeah, it's it's basically so my right arm is my best arm so I use it for everything so 
it's just wearing out. So, got a little ultrasound today and some Advil. I'm ready to take on the world. <laughs> yes. Micah, do do you do? My head. Yeah, do you do? Mike is popping pills and he's feeling great. <laughs> That's like a real trucker. Low rider. Yeah, really. <laughs> oh, the gal truck just got in front of me. Oh, now he's slamming on his brakes. Don't forget, f uh, 55, Micah. Well, I'm going 50 at the moment until you guys catch up. All right, low and slow, low and slow. Yeah, this gallon truck. Um, Javius, let's get in the left lane. I'm going to send the gallon truck back, so be ready because he's going to be uh, slowing go down very... Oh, did you see across the street there was a... Oh, no, we got to get off here. Stay in the right lane, Javius. No, you want to be in the left. Left lane's fine. Left lane is fine? Yeah. Okay. I'm following you, my guy. 50 mile an hour. Okay, slow it. Corner up ahead, it says. Brake check. Did the and gallon truck brake sure. check you? That's my fault. Ooh. Well, maybe. There's all kinds of shenanigans going on back here. <laughs> the problem with bringing up the rear. Okay, and we're going to be getting, say, stay in the right lane because we'll be getting off again. Ah, cool. We're actually hopefully going to get off the freeway and get some back road action. That sounded weird. Let me rethink no. that phrase. No, as long as you said, as long as you didn't say back door action. Oh, yeah, I did. We're all, oh, we're all that's our, right, right there. The dogs are all barking. <laughs> Anyone See, want a puppy? Already, you're already getting back door action. Look at all them dogs barking all the time. Bark, 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 bark. Is that uh, Port the Port Port I did try to share your uh, your the post Simone made for the puppies, and I didn't get flagged that I know of. So, oh good. The ones with the waggly tails—they're so sweet. They're really sweet puppies, but they gotta go. Okay, so it looks like we're gonna have to get in the middle lane. There's going to be a white truck coming back, Javius. I'm so far back, it's not going to matter. Yeah, just 45, Micah? Yeah, we're going to slow down to 45. I'll get there eventually. I'm coasting up to 50 now, so let's see. That, that'll, that'll change when we get on this hill. Salem, Massachusetts. Oh, this is pretty. Hey, there's that bridge. Which one? I always see. Off to the right. The Portland Bridge? Yeah, the one that got like a half a circle upwards. Oh, yeah. And it goes out. Uh... Oh. That goes over to Washington, doesn't it? It might. The Route 5 exit there? Yeah. Yeah, that goes. That's picking up I-5 towards Seattle. Oh, we're going... Oh, we're not going on the high part of the bridge. We're going low. Low, 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 low. making you slow down it's okay i needed to you sure uh not about this much but <laughs> partially yes the boys are back in town do, 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 do. Up, yes he did no uh come on over you can come over you're clear sorry i had i had momentum going i was roger that hand he always says that to me 
think he just likes to pass people. No. I think I'm he's not, secretly I... a NASCAR fan. <laughs> no, no, watch this. As soon as we have a right turn, I can do that. Um, hey. No, Which I've always learned... left. I've ner learned not to get up the side, Micah. More, <laughs> off, more often than not, we're swapping paint, if that's the case. Oh, he's always he's playing. swapping conditioning offs. Right lane ends. I'm in the left lane. You're clear to come over. Oh, you're already over. Never mind. I got all this music going through my head. I know, me too. I've been listening to George Strait all day. <laughs> Wait, uh, Scott. One... No, that's George Thurgood. <laughs> <laughs> So it says trucks 55, do you want to go 55 or do you want to go 50? Uh, we can go 55. Okay. Because I can't drive 55. Bark, bark, bark. It's my nemesis. The Did Isuzu. you say 55 or 50? 55. Yeah, okay, that's my thought. And already Arthur's falling behind. Wait, why are we going south? Oh, because we're going to turn right. Probably at Eugene. Eugene. And we're passing Salem Newports. Okay. That's right. Menthol. Salem Menthol. Yeah, we were on the east coast. First we passed with Salem, and then we... Oh, you know Salem, and then Salem, and then Salem. Oh, did I crash the Isuzu? Oops. <laughs> I might have had a fender bender with the Isuzu truck. He's you know, always... you better be careful. You're going to give UPS a bad name. He's been in my way quite a bit. It wasn't Joe, was it? Are you UPS Peterbilt? Joe the Isu Joe Isuzu? Yeah. <gasps> and yes, I know these are Kenworths. I knew that before. It's a K100. It would be a P100 if it was a Peterbilt. I just said it wrong because I'm an idiot. Nobody answered that. Didn't even think. <laughs> so I was playing around last night in SnowRunner with the 57X on my wife's map, and I found that if you put it in high gear, man, that thing cooks. Yeah. And it smashes its way uh, into oblivion. I think I did like probably 250 damage over the entire night. <laughs> I kept having to repair it. But it'll rock it forward and take whatever it's carrying with it. So it's a pretty amazing truck, actually. I didn't. I'll tell you what, I, I got stuck like once. Videos, like you were talking about, like people were just really upset about that. Oh, they're truck. so mad. Yeah. And I was just like, I can't believe how many spoiled brats there are out there. Well, not only that, but I think they missed the point. Like, the part of it is the challenge, you know. Why do people like? Why Getting did off. people? Why did people drive the Zill in spin tires? But they did. I, in fact, there was an there was an award for completing a map using just the Zill. Yeah, right. Yeah, I think because it's that, a challenge. Yeah. But these trucks are not even that. They're they're not even a challenge to. to well, it depends on the map. Obviously. If you take the 57X on a map that is all mud, it's going to suck. Same thing with the Transtar. Same thing with the GMCs. You know, same thing with the a lot of the trucks in the game. There are very specific Russian trucks that are just going to do better. But I think they're plenty, they're plenty fine. They worked well. And I did, a, you know, probably three or four more hours of testing while, while driving with my wife last night. And I... I got stuck maybe maybe twice where I had to winch out. Did you make it? Arthur? No, no, no. I'm not even close. Right, I'm not even at. I'm not, I'm not at the light we'll, yet. We'll pull over. Sorry. I'm tempted to go through. I'm waiting. So find. Let's see where we at. Sunwise. Yeah. Yeah. So, I was just really surprised how bad people were reacting to. I know. To it. Yeah. I'm gonna let a puppy out. 
It's kind of like when you watch the news and like you go to the channel, different channels, and they all report the same thing. Mm-hmm. You know, there was a like a time where people there was I forget who it was. There was something that they they hated George Bush obviously, and then he they I forget what the thing was. They were like there was a certain they're talking about uh, Obama and he had like a, as he was running, and they're like he has this certain gravitas, and like every freaking news channel said the word gravitas like during those like two week period I'm like oh and so what I, <laughs> this is like that uh, I don't know where I was going with that I'm not completely lost <laughs> what were we talking oh, about I think you're just talking about how everybody's oh with the, the trucks yeah like everybody's saying the same thing a truck with all wheel drive should never be released in this game well or without all wheel drive it's like yeah, well, it's, yeah. Well, well no I mean we're, I'm, I'm, I'm over by the way we can start going well, we gotta wait for James to get back. From that. He did. Oh, he's oh, okay. Here we go. Okay. My son came down to get oh. a drink, so he's gonna watch for the puppy to be ready to come back in. Tell him thanks. I That's did. Awesome. So it's one of those, you know. Once again, I, I I don't completely disagree, but I don't think that every truck can be the superpower Russian truck. Yeah. You know, the Tatra was awesome. The, the crocodile was awesome. The rovers? Eh. <laughs> the Kodiak? <laughs> I love... I, I, or that... It, uh, what, that's not the Kodiak. What's it called? The Commander or whatever it's called? The, the General? The General, yeah. That, that truck brig- is... No, the Brigadier. Brigadier. There you go, Brigadier. Uh, that truck is not great. It's really not good at all, actually. It's good on the same maps that the these new Western Star Trucks are good on. And that's okay. Every time they come back, they add more stuff into the, each of the old maps, too. So you're going to get some use out of it. Yeah. Uh, but anyway, I just, whatever. People are always unhappy about something. I've learned that with the farm sim stuff, like with the DLCs. They're just, and a lot of times they don't even watch the video. They just comment, an angry comment about the product. Because I'm like, they're like, well, it doesn't do this or that. And I'm like, actually, if you watch the video, it does. You just didn't watch the video and started commenting on it because you have an opinion on it. Which is fine, but you haven't really watched or tested it. And I think that's where a lot of those angry comments have come from. These are people that looked at it. They might have bought it, but they didn't really test it out. There are some that did, though. Uh, and there were a couple of people, and they just weren't happy. And, and that's fine. But it's just funny to me. It's like... Well, I, like I, was that, I, was, I was sort of that way as well, too. Like, I just thought it was a cash grab. Yeah. My first thought was... This cash is just grab. a cash grab. Why would you bring highway trucks into this game? Right. You know, because you're not going to be able to use them for anything. And then once I drove the trucks, I realized these trucks are, are kind of buffed. Yeah, they're actually you know I mean? a little stronger than they should be in some cases. Yeah, they, they, are, they are not as weak as you think. So they'll have a place. Yeah, they're on par with the other American trucks. Another thing, another way to look at it, though, is the more manufacturer tie-ins where you're getting actual, legit, that's the truck design, I mean, that I think that's good. Versus right. made-up trucks. Right. Mm, yeah. Because then you're actually using what people actually use to get through some of this stuff. Right. But then you got to take in the fact, too, that they would actually clear the boulders before they would start running those trucks over them. Oh, That's true, too. <laughs> I so wish that we could have that. I would say just go on forward to Newport because we're it's the sun's going down, but we're almost there. Right, yeah. And then no... we'll, we'll spend the night in Newport. Yeah, we only got nine minutes, or nine miles, eight miles now. Wow, this is beautiful, though. Enough for me to stall out. Come on, truck. <laughs> just do like me, man. Let the game drive the truck or uh, throttle the truck and you just steer it. Do they actually have a mode where it drives itself? Well, a cruise. I just took the cruise control. So I if I could if I could drive if I could drive like you guys, I would do it. 35 up here. Down to 30. 
That's just a suggestion. Speed suggestions. <laughs> I'm getting messages on my phone. I can't see them. My wife's got my phone. I don't know where she put it. Stop me. And I've got my Apple Watch, but I don't know how to... I never use it, so I don't know how to open the... Gosh, the dogs are going to bark this entire thing. Aren't those guys going or what? I'm not going to go until we all get here. Okay, I'm going. Tap to open. I'm tapping. Quiet. Turn digital crown to eject water. I don't know if I'd open that message. No, it's something, something with my phone. I'm saying there's moisture in it or something. Come on. Yeah. Okay, this might be really bad. Can you see who texted me, babe? I will say if you can swing to the other side, the other the the other lot to the to the right, I would try it. Thank you. I don't, I don't know. know. We'll we'll see if I can make it. He seems to check his phone at like ten o'clock at night. Yes, honey. Is he visiting the baby? Why is she using my clean shirt as a towel? I guess I made it. <laughs> Can you open the screen door? It's hot in here. It's Stoffe. Well, oh, come on. Uh, I keep hitting parking brake when I mean hit the jig brake. What's the matter? <laughs> Did you block it? <laughs> Let's see. High value for me. First one below. Okay. Drive. Oh, Javius! Is... You're touching me. It's a no collision. It's a no touchy zone. No touchy zone. Well, that's not the way I could see it. No. I meant you guys at the Ooh, gas touchy. station. You got it. Gas it is. Gas her up. Gas her up. Unless there is a repair shop nearby. Ooh, there is. <gasps> but there's no shop. fuel. You need a repairs? Well, probably just normal I road wear and tear. Updated. I don't need gas. I'm gonna go for repairs. Pull harder. That's what she said. You can't or you shan't. What? Are you, why are you trying to get off? You want to get the bassinet on there? Ugh. All right, give me a minute. I'm trying to park. Why didn't it accept me? I was perfectly on the. What the? Yeah, I just had to hit enter. I thought I was lined up in the right spot, but... All right, just skip. Whatever. Which right. way to your uh, repair shop? To the right. Thank you. Continue. Um, so, I, so Mike and I are doing high-value cargo. You did long distance, right, Javius? I did. So now we're all on the same page. So ladies and gentlemen... Hopefully you enjoyed this video. We're going to spend the night and record another one in the morning. If I can get my truck to start, I just stalled. Repairs. Let's so see. Odd. Should we try to do a paint job? <laughs> Not yet. I got, I got right, 77,000. So anyway. All right. Have a good night, everybody. See you next time. Bye.